I'm joined by Cecilia today. Do you see that? The view of the city? Jump! Oh wow, oh, there's one coming! <laughs> Before we get into this video, I want to give a shout out to Armando Lopez. He told me to go to Crystal de las Noas during the night, so I'm here. And everyone else who's been interacting with me, who are from Torreon or who are Mexicans, thank you guys for giving me all your suggestions and wishing me all the best during my travels. I really appreciate you guys. All right, let's get into this video. Good evening from Torreon, Mexico. I'm back in the city and I'm joined by Cecilia today and today we are going to Cristo de las Noas. There is a Christ monument on top of the mountain and that's where we are headed right now. Alright, let's go. Wow, I see that there is a big lineup to go up. <laughs> Do you see the amount of people that are here to take the cable bus to the church? Well, there's a big lineup to go up to the uh, Cristo de las Noas. But there are there is another way of going up to Cristo de las Noas as well. So I guess we can go by our car. What do you think? You wanna take the car? So since Cecilia has her car, I think it is better that we drive up there instead of waiting in line to go up to Cristo de las Navas. But maybe next time we can go on this one of these cable buses. But right now I really want to make it up there before you know we lose light. And look at this. <laughs> well too bad I guess we'll try it out next time when there is not that many people. Okay, let's go for this drive. We're gonna go right there. So it's like 50 pesos entrance to park here to go in and he didn't have change for 500 pesos so he's asking us when you're on the way back just give me the money yeah and now we're trying to look for parking it's so full Again. Yeah, there's literally no spot here to park. Oh my god, it's full. Yeah. Park here. There? Yeah. Do it. So this is where we parked. This is not really a parking spot, but you know, there's no other spot here right now. It's so busy right now Because I think it's because it's sunset hour and everybody want to be here. I don't know. We're gonna go find out Why there's so many people here at this hour right now? <laughs> this is the welcome sign at Cristo de las Noas right there and we still have to walk all the way up there. But look at the view. The view of the city is beautiful from here. Wow. Oh, no. 
<laughs> and this is where people have like additional parking. We have entered these gates and we are here at Cristo de las Noas. So as soon as you enter, there is a washroom here. Manu. So Cecilia, she wanted to use the washroom. She went in. How about we go take a tour what the washroom looks like here. So you pay like five pesos if you want, I guess. This is the men's washroom. The girls' washroom is over there. Okay, we're gonna wait for Cecilia. And then we will go inside and tour the whole place. Okay, so is here, and now we're gonna go ahead with our tour. Okay. Yeah. It's like a souvenir store. And candy's there. Yeah, it's like a souvenir store where people can buy stuff before they leave the Cristo de las Nuevas. Look at this one. Nice. Really nice stuff? Oh, wow, nice. Yeah, some soaps, air, beautiful. Wow, a lot of art here. Very nice. So this is a great opportunity because I'm gonna introduce you guys to a really nice Mexican dessert. And I will tell you why it is special for me because I've had it before. Not in Mexico, but somewhere else. And that candy is this this stuff over here so we're gonna get it it's for 45 pesos and let's get this okay so we got our dessert <laughs> it's called dulce de leche that's what it's called and I'm gonna try it right now So good. <laughs> and the reason why this is very special is because we have the same type of sweet in Pakistan. This is called burfi. So if you're Pakistani, Indian, if you know anything about Indian sweets, if you have tried burfi before, this tastes exactly like burfi. So this is why I said that this is very special and I've tried this before outside of Mexico. <laughs> So I love this sweet stuff. Yeah? <laughs> Look at the view there. That's the moon. See that? The view of the city. Wow. And there's so much breeze, like you can feel the wind. And it's so fresh right now, where it's really fresh. Yeah. 
and that's where the Christ monument is. Yeah, really nice. It's really nice to be able to fly the drone here and see everything from all the way above. You know, it's a whole different perspective. But let me tell you a little bit about what I've learned about this place so far. This crash monument is actually about 20 meters tall and it was built in 1983 by an architecture named Vladimir Alvarado. That was his name. And ever since then, hundreds and thousands of people have been coming here and visiting this really sacred place. And right now, there's tons of people here and they're all here to experience this whole place. Everything is made out of like, you know, raw, everything has a different structure. It almost feels like I'm in Jerusalem. What do you feel about this place? It's really peaceful, but I really like the view. Like the view? We have the here, Jesus with us, a lot of people enjoy it. Yeah. It's so different to visit this place at night, but it's great in the in the evening or morning, morning it's yeah. better it. yeah it is actually like, yeah so you want to go inside the church yeah let's go inside So it's really nice that they have a window here at the church and from the window they have the view of the whole city. So that is really nice.
yeah it's really nice to be in there it's very peaceful very quiet you know that's what church is about church is about going to a place where you forget about your problems the bad things that are happening in your life and just remember that there is God there is something bigger than us so it is nice to go inside yeah. and feel that you know that's why a lot of people are here a lot of people are here to forget the problems and the bad things in their life and they're here to accept and experience the good things they have in their life so it's really nice to be able to experience all that over here okay what's next where, where are we headed now um, let's go downstairs downstairs <laughs> And I think what makes the view more beautiful is the moon today. It's making the place look more epic. First, we saw the view from here. Then we saw the view from the top, but then there's also an option to go there <laughs> and have a nice 360 view of the city. So we're gonna go up there right now. really open space and look at the view here wow Can literally see everything all around you <laughs> but down there is the cable bus that takes you back to the city and I think we should go there yeah yeah there's so many restaurants over here and there's also restaurants there I guess so we're gonna <laughs> go check out all those spots oh yeah I see a dinosaur there as well so yeah let's go yeah let's go down there yeah, yeah. so once you come down from the stairs you have more vendors here, they're selling you stuff. These guys have some food. And then there's someone there selling art. And they have a lot of art here. Hola amigo, buenas noches. Yes. Yeah. And that's the way to go down? Hola. <laughs> Gracias. Uh, soy de Canada. Okay. Sí. Sí. Oh, thank you. Are you from here? From Torreon? Torreon. Torreon. Nice, nice. Oh, it's very dark here. <laughs> yeah. Oh, nice. We got the Torreon sign, and I think I should take a picture here. Jump. So, all these people, they are waiting to go down back to the city on the cable bus. Look at the line up there. Wow. Really nice lights. I have a thing for lights. I really like lights. So it's nice to see like really nice lights over here. <laughs> oh wow, there's a dinosaur there. <laughs> and it's moving.
<laughs> wow, it's crazy to see like dinosaur moving like this. But at some point, there were dinosaurs like that, and they were massive like this, and they were they were on this earth. That's crazy to even imagine, to even think about it. Wow. Really nice, eh? Yeah, tons of people here. They all take the pictures close to the Korean sign and close to the dinosaur. But wow, really nice. Wow, there's the cable bus down there. Wow, look at this. Smells good here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it smells like food over here. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, we're restaurant over there. Nice. But before we go towards the other side, I want to see what's over here. So let's check it out. Yeah. Oh, wow. Look at this, the cable bus. Right there. Oh, there's an angel there to take pictures. <laughs> Can you see? Over here. Learn. Oh, it's a real angel. Yeah. Over here. <laughs> oh, wow. So close. Oh, wow, there's one coming from there. <laughs> it feels like it's right on your head, eh? <laughs> wow. I can feel the breeze, like literally when it passes you, you can feel the, a little bit of the breeze on top of your head. <laughs> really <cool. laughs> they have a little bit of a play area for kids. You know, a lot of people have kids. And they bring their kids here so that the kids are not all over the place. They're just playing in one area. Yeah. I hear music over there. Yeah. Let's go there. It's a real yeah. one. <laughs> yeah. Live music. There's a band there. Really nice stuff. There's a band and everyone's having a good time here. And there's a restaurant here. Look at this. A restaurant with a view. You wanna go? Yeah? What? Is it here? Yeah, we're at this place and we're planning to sit here and grab some food. And with this beautiful view. So because they were playing really loud music, I could not like explain what we were doing there. But down there, they have like an observation center and you only pay like 20 pesos and you're able to observe and it's like Jupiter and also the moon. 
at first we saw Jupiter, it was like a really tiny <laughs> dot. And then later he's like, if you guys want to wait for five minutes, I'm going to turn the side and we're going to observe the moon. He turned it to the other side and we observed the moon and the moon was massive. And we got a really nice clear picture and also a video. It was a really, really nice experience. So if you guys are going to come here during the night, also try out that experience because you will absolutely love it. Just in case if you're wondering the price, you know, this is for 240 pesos. You get like 400 grams of boneless and also the fries with it. And then you got 30 pesos for the drink and the water. See, I got some price. apple juice. Yeah, those are the normal prices for the food over here at this place called this gravity pool. Are you enjoying your food love? Yes. Oh nice. How about the view? <laughs> I am mal del porco right now after eating those boneless. <laughs> so full right now. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys enjoyed Cristo de las Noas. This is one of the main attractions here in Torreon and I absolutely enjoyed my time. The church, the 360 view. And I think there's a lot of history in this place, which I haven't learned yet. So I'm sure that I'm going to come back to this place and learn more about Cristo de las Novas. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will see you in the next video. God's energy. <laughs>